So <clears throat> this is a video on uh, some of the work uh, about corner weighting, a 2003 uh, Mini Cooper R53. Uh, right now I have the scales set up, they're in place, and uh, the jacks are just there. I, I, uh, there's no tension on the jack, but the scales are under the wheels. Uh, it's done on all four sides, all four corners I should say. So what we're going to do first is weigh the car as it is. Uh, the other thing that you want to check before you even put them on the scale is your ride height for each one of the wheels because as you start to adjust the corner weighting, uh, you'll want to keep track of that, see uh, what kind of changes that there were. And even though it looked like I had a pretty close setup before, I was actually off uh, about a half an inch. I'll pick it up from there. So the first batch of numbers that I have after figuring out the scales uh, left front 855, right front 805, left rear 530, right rear 645. So in order to get the corner weighting right, uh, I'm going to have to make some adjustments in the front. I'm uh, going to make some adjustments in the rear and we'll see if we can't dial it in. Let you know how it goes. So after a couple of hours of pulling the tires off, adjusting the coilovers, putting them back on, remeasuring and whatnot, Here's the uh, final numbers that I came up with, 840 on the left front, 860 on the right front, 550 on the left rear, 550 on the right rear. Uh, I have a little bit of a wedge there, obviously you can see I'm 50.4%, 50 but I think if I get in the car that'll probably uh, level that out a little bit there, and uh, we should be okay. So we're going to leave it at that, we'll see how it works.